Happy Thursday, everybody. Pinpoint Weather 12 meteorologist Brittany Trumpy here. We are seeing a beautiful sunny start to your day. It was a cold start with those temperatures in the single digits. As we look forward to your forecast for this afternoon, it does stay cooler out there. Temperatures topping out in the upper 20s. Some spots lucky enough to get up to 30 degrees. Lots of sunshine out there and we are staying dry. If we look forward to this weekend, we do have that winter storm watch in effect for most of our area. It goes um, from a Friday evening all the way through till Saturday evening around four o'clock. What we're tracking is a low pressure system that's going to form just off the Florida coast overnight tonight. That's then gonna track to the north throughout the day and start to impact our weather very late Friday and into Saturday. That low is going to move right off the coast, causing a chance for some uh, significant snowfall, some pretty strong wind gusts, as well as some coastal flooding. So here are the three scenarios. We have option one, which is the closest to the to the coast. That would usually lead to a bit of a rain snow mix, pushing that uh, rain a little bit closer to the shore. As of the last couple model runs, that's looking less likely. Option number two is that classic track where we're seeing some of those higher snowfall amounts and then we have option number three which moves that center of the storm a little bit further off to the east further away from the coast kind of cuts off on some of those snowfall amounts a few of the models are hinting at the chance uh, for some pretty significant snowfall amounts anywhere closer to almost two feet of snow out towards the cape meanwhile rhode island seeing the chance for anywhere from about a foot to a foot and a half again this is just one of the models opinions on what's going to happen we're continuing to uh, figure out exactly how much snow we are expecting for our area but as far as potential impacts heavy snow continues to be a big concern that's going to lead to some issues with some travels we're going to see some potential power outages not only because of the snow but also because of the strong wind gusts that we're expecting and of course we're also seeing the chance for some coastal flooding for the rest of your thursday though sunshine on the way stays cold out there friday during the day not so bad a couple of extra clouds and then we see that snow moving in very late friday to saturday you can head over to wpri.com we've got that full seven day forecast you can check it out anytime you like